I clicked live. Okay. And now it's live. It's really good to know at times. Right, William? Sure is. So you got William and you got myself in there? Mm -hmm. And it shows we're live. No, it shows we're live. Let's see if we're live. Oh, there we are. There we are. There's Mutt and Jeff. And that'd be really funny if you knew what Mutt and Jeff was. I don't think even your mama knows what Mutt and Jeff is. And we're uh, starting to build an audience there and they're coming on on a Monday night and a cold Monday night. We got weather warnings coming, folks. We're gonna be warning everybody the weather's gonna be nasty. Um, mostly in Canada, I think, in Manitoba and Saskatchewan and that. And they're expecting a lot of snow, high winds. It'll be a good day to park. I still have uh, three deliveries to do in Winnipeg and I'm going to make sure I park because I don't want to be uh, dealing with any of that stuff. Right, William? Yeah. So, William, you're off school now, eh? Chatelaine yeah. Mendoza is there. Hey, Chat, how are you doing? Chatelaine Mendoza, front cover of this month's magazine. When does she become Chatelaine McKenzie? Pretty soon, I hope. And David McKenzie's there, Keith Bazin's there, Wanda McCartney. And Keith Bazin says, good evening, Dave and William. Good evening to you. And uh, Chatelaine says, hi, handsome McKenzie men. You know, she thinks McKenzie men are very handsome. At least I hope she does. Yeah. Otherwise, David's got a problem. <laughs> yeah. And um, Marsha Pitt, evening, you two. Snow started here at noon. Oh, I sure hope the snow doesn't start here until very late tomorrow because we don't need the snow. It is uh, going to be uh, quite a snow, lots of snow they predict, and high winds. Yeah. And uh, I'm going to be running around Winnipeg with like uh, three skids in my trailer. Uh, one I hope to get rid of in the next uh, three, four hours, but then I'll have two skids and I have to go from one end of the city to the other with two skids of product in a trailer. I should almost switch to the five ton. Take it off yep. the trailer, put it onto the five ton. I mean, it wouldn't be that hard back up to the dock and then back to the five ton up. Oh, and Keith Basin says, and good evening to Angie too. Oh, and Chatelaine says, hi, beautiful Angie. Hello. And, uh, oh, 2022, 2022. That, we gotta wait two years. Why? It's pretty much 2021 right now, so like a oh, year. Yeah, so maybe just a year. Well, what if they get hey, married in December? And what? here's Fred. And, uh, and, uh, and Sparkers in Deutsch? Sparkers in Deutsch? Duma Koo. Duma Schwein. He's speaking Sims. No. Simeon. Yeah. He was yeah. I know. Uh, because, was see Fred's <laughs> name? Can, can, can you How do you know? Because I do. Can you uh, pronounce Fred's last name? Uh,. Wade Jr. Nope, it's Schwinweed. Schwinder. Schwinder. Savinder. Savinda. Oh, I screwed it up already, Fred. Swinder? Savinda. I screwed I screwed it up. I screwed it up. That makes me feel bad. Because I had it down pat. And um you know what? I could go over here for one minute. And um because I had it, I had it. I was practicing it and practicing it and practicing it because I wanted to say it right. But um, uh, I've got to uh, make sure I, let me click on the right one here. What's this here? How do I get rid of this? <laughs> um, there's that. Um, whoops. I think this might be it. Just wait, let me check. Oh, I turn my volume down. It is S-C-H-W-A-N-E-W-E-D-E. -E -E. Or short version, Schwanewede. 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 Shanavita. I got it. We got it. Shanavita, right? Ench, does that sound right? I have no idea what you're talking about. This that's Fred's last name. Oh, okay. So I wanted to make sure I got it because uh, 
Uh, Fred is a, a good, a great fan of ours. Mary Annie Lewis. Hey, Mary, I saw they uh, s sent out your uh, $50 uh, gift card today uh, by uh, Special Courier. So you should have it probably within two days. And uh, Zenfer Lefort is there and says, Hope uh, is all a Merry Christmas. Yes, I just need some sleep. Chris ha Halliboy Anhorn says, Good evening. Yes, I'm loading in Regina for Calgary. See what happens. Hope I make it home. Yes, safe travels. Andrea Duham is there. Hey, Andrea. Hi from the McKenzie family here. TJ Young, good evening, Dave and family. Arthur Art is from Ottawa. Hey, hey, Ottawa. How are you doing? And uh, Annie, Mary Annie Lewis says, which one is John McKenzie? Right here. Right there. And uh, do you ever come to Ottawa? Yes, I do sometimes, but not lately. March Pitt says, evening, Angie. Gordon Morrison, uh, Morrison, sorry, I can, can't use lipstick. Good evening, Dave and family. And Shauna Gray, Adventures with Storm and Odin. Says, you made it home before the snow. That's great. I haven't yet, Shauna. I haven't yet. We just yep. came and we had supper. I'm going to the truck. I still have three more drops that I can't do till after midnight and tomorrow. So I'm hoping to get rid of that trailer before I get hit with it. Unless Maggie, Teresa McKenzie, good evening. How are you doing? Nancy Hogan is there. John Duham, evening McKenzie family. Hey, John. And you know who this is saying was good? Short and Eden. No. No. Uh, do, do you remember uh, Angie? No. <laughs> oh, we just practiced that. Okay, let's okay. practice it again. Well, you can see how it's written, right? Schwanner Rida. Shwanavita. 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 I'm sorry, Fred. We're terrible. We're gonna, we are going to practice it, though. We're going to practice it. He said we did it very good, though. Yes. Yeah, when, we when were, you had the, uh, had the recording in front recording of you. Going. Yeah. <laughs> Arthur, Arthur says, where are you? We're at uh, Tim Hortons, and we're sitting in the back of the van. Uh, we're sitting in the back of the van. Yeah, we're sitting here just around, watching the Tims go in, and we'll watch it come out again, because we <laughs> don't last long inside. Tim Hortons really makes me cry. Oh, zero people now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, just dropped everything. That was just, so cringy. Yeah, yeah, everybody just left. Sean Gray, but you're off the highway, and they're just in town. That's much better since winds will be yeah. bad, yeah. and the load between Brandon and Winnipeg, yes. Oh, LOL, I mean, what city are you in? We are in a city called Winterpeg, Manitoba, Canada. Winterpeg, because Portage of Maine and Winnipeg is one of the coldest places ever in Canada. So it's Winnipeg that I'm at. And uh, I'm gonna go and have a nap before I start uh, loading and stuff like that. But just out with the family, we had some Popeyes. Cause I'm Popeye the Sailor Man. I live in a garbage can. I eat up the worms and spit out the germs. Cause I'm Popeye the Sailor Man. You have your spinach? Yeah, right John? John McKenzie, John Wayne McKenzie, yeah. and we got Andrew here. He's going to sing for you in a few minutes and do some tricks. <laughs> uh, some tricks. No, because this is a short video because I have to go to Fred bed, Dave. Says, LOL. He's, uh, Andrew's going to provide the talent for the rest of the videos. I'm going to show some tricks. Okay. Yeah, he's going to show some tricks. His greatest and, talent is how cute he is. And Kitty says, hey, Dave and family. Reddy Wagner says, good evening, Dave. We're on for the storm, they say, in southern Saskatchewan. It's going to be terrible. And it says, which one is Angie McKenzie? She's out just working the lot right now, getting some money for us. <laughs> yeah. That was terrible. I can't believe you said that. We're going to be in trouble. She's the one always behind the camera. And the reason why is she says she doesn't want to take the wind out of our sails because she's so beautiful. Oh yeah. And nobody would pay any more attention to us if they saw the NG baby. Yeah. I, uh, one time she met this guy that was standing on the corner doing this. Oh my God. And, uh, and, uh, and uh, she says, hi. And he went, 
what's your name? And she said, Angie. And he turned around, Angie, Angie. And then he turned around, picked up a guitar and went, Angie, Angie, why do you make Dave want to cry? Is it the loving that you do or the yelling as well too? And we're back at one viewer. <laughs> we're back to one yeah. viewer. See, now you guys don't know what it meant when I went, but people who know the Rolling Stones would recognize what that is. Because let me tell you guys that they were big rock singers. They had golden fingers and their love everywhere they go. But the well, tongue is Gene Simmons, isn't it? And that's not... That's, that's Kiss, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, no, no. No, the tongue of Rolling Stones. That's their... I, th their, I thought that's their, Kiss. Yeah, that's Kiss. It was no, Kiss. They that's decorate kiss. their it's face their in white and blue. Yeah. No. See, yeah, even you guys don't know. Let, let me go right here, and I'll go Rolling Stones logo with a tongue. Logo? Go. Logo. That's Gene Simmons. What the heck about this page? It's a, it's, See, they're agreeing with me. Page? It's from yeah. your era, and they're telling me, yeah, it's Kiss, not Rolling Stones. Well, Kiss would kiss stick his tongue out, too, but the Rolling Stone, I'll show you. Because they're big rock singers. They got yeah. golden singers. <laughs> and they're love. There we go. Rolling Stone t shirt. Okay, Mark is agreeing with you. Oh, of course. The, the t shirt. But people no, are agreeing with me. This is their image. This is the cover of the Rolling Stone. Oh, you're talking about that. You when doing you're it. doing the tongue, yeah. I think of Gene Simmons. Because they're big rock singers. They got golden fingers and they love everywhere they go. Well, they sing about beauty and they sing about Whatever, it's a 50-50 split. $10,000 Some people said that, but mostly it's just Mark agreeing with you because he's your best bud. They Everyone else is saying Gene Simmons too. That's that what they would have got. Buy, but they're never <laughs> gonna be a something alone alone because they can't get their picture and they can't get their picture on the cover <laughs> of the rolling stones rolling <laughs> stones gonna see my picture on the cover stones gonna buy five copies for my mother stones gonna see my picture on the cover the cover of the rolling stones <laughs> now if we're talking about mark matthew He's got this groovy old lady named a cocaine Katie who embroiders on his jeans. He's got his old gray-haired daddy driving his limousine. He's got all the babes that money can buy, but he'll never have an Angie, you know why? Who knows why? <laughs> but Rolling Stones. That, it's still that? Gene Simmons to me. The way your tongue did it looked like it's Gene Simmons. Yeah, it looks, Rolling Stones. Yeah, I Rolling see this. Stones. Like Rolling Stones is more like this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Instead of like, there's their logo. I get it, but when you cr turn your head and you like point your tongue, that's Gene Simmons. <laughs> see, you were pointing your tongue and not having it flat like them. Yeah, that's yeah because, Dad, you're doing this. That's because I remember uh, Angie said she fell in love with me one time when I was drinking a big gulp and I licked the bottom of the cup with my tongue. That would be disgusting. <laughs> I would not fall in love with you for that. And that's all, folks. <laughs> yeah, there's a cherry at the bottom of the cup and I scooped it up with my tongue. Yuck. And I could pick my own nose with my tongue. Ew. <laughs> Oh, that is gross. I even did it. Did you see that, Angie? What? No, I don't even want to look at okay. you. Uh, I'm uh, sleep deparation, folks. So uh, <laughs> deparation. let's go on. Kevin Lambert's <laughs> watching. Hey, Ke Kevin would have known it was Rolling Stones. Mark knew it was Rolling Stones. Mario Papio says, you're right, Angie. See? Dave is handsome. No, yeah. That's what, <laughs> that's what I said. <laughs> and Dave Ferguson says, Angie, I think Dave is tired and needs nappy. Yes, I think so. Uh, uh, Dave needs his old man nap. And Marsha Pitt says, nice cover up. The doghouse is calling your name. You know, at the end of this video, when you're killing time, I want you to go through all the comments and see all the people who said that I was right. And then the one lone person named Mark Matthew who says you were right. <laughs> I, I'm trying to find any and they're just... Uh, they're all saying and me. And saying you're too young, Angie. 
<laughs> I'm too young. Spinach, potatoes, and eggs. Krispy Kreme. Any of those around? Oh, Arthur. Oh, I love Krispy Kreme. And uh, Mary says, whose boy is in front of you, with you? You know what? I've been wondering that myself. We're still waiting on the DNA. And um, Fred says, in this time, we need this. LOL. Keep singing. Thanks, Fred. Yes, because I'm your guy's goof. I might be a goof, but I'm your guy's goof. Because here on Canadian Trucking Magazine, uh, which is your page, I am happy to come on and act like William. And we can't forget, William's becoming a man. He's growing a mustache. Yes, he's growing a stash. You can see it. <laughs> Andrew is very excited about that. <laughs> <laughs> William's been shaving for years and cut himself both times. <laughs> see, that's a joke. You did. Storm warning for Saskatchewan. Yes, I'm going to put those up. Arthur says, cold, brr, stay warm, no kidding. And uh, I think we've caught up on the comments. Uh, we scared half the people away, and the numbers, I think, dropped dramatically. And uh, Marsha Pitt says, TMFI. Too much blank info when you're doing that tongue gross exactly. stuff. <laughs> hey, there's Gary Cox. Gary, you should have been on when I was singing Cover of the Rolling Stones. You'd sing that with me. And there's Jaws Duham. Hi, guys. Hey, Jaws. And uh, I think I've caught up. So we're going to do a draw tonight. We're going to do a draw for another $50 visa. $50 visa. Because we love giving them away. Uh, so far, Annie, uh, Mary Annie Lewis is on here. One, one. And Fred. Uh, Good old pal, Fred. Svanaviter. Oh. Svanaviter. Svanaviter. Yeah, I'll say it with a Swedish accent. Because, yeah. Svanaviter. Yeah, Svenska. Um, isn't that funny, eh? Like, if you say Sprechen in Deutsch, as if you speak German, or Palivu Francais, but to say you speak Swedish, all you say is Svenska. Svenska. And Svenska means I speak Swedish. So you're just going to say Svenska in Sweden, and everyone's going to be talking to you. You're not Everybody's going to be talking to me. Taksamika. And, um, so, so yes, so we got him on there who won, and who else won? There's somebody else. Uh, oh, and uh, what's his name? It's not on here who won. And John Duham says, uh, do you broken phone from singing? <laughs> He's got a broken phone from my singing. Pat Gray's there. Hey, Pat Gray. Daniel Duham's there. Hi, guys. Uh, I saw you guys were all entered. That was fantastic. And hey, Dave, I might win again from Mary Annie Lewis. Yes, you can. I just have to interrupt you for a second because it drives me crazy every time. Do you know the difference between the letter M and N? No. They both sound the same to me. What about you, John? Yeah, same. They yeah, sound right, like John. M yeah. and right, John? Yeah. <laughs> John Nen Nenensky? Yeah, we should eat some honey. Because you always and... say do ham, like you're mm -hmm. eating a piece of ham. It's yeah. not ham, it's han. It's an N and not an M. Yeah, M. Yes, that's finally. Yeah. And Jaws. We've been trying to tell him, right, John? <laughs> Did you know you're named after John? I don't know why you're even trying to bother pronouncing like Fred's last name you. when you can't even <laughs> pronounce the Doohans. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> oh, Lord. And Dawn is there. Merry Christmas to all of you. Oh, she shouldn't have said that because you know what I'm going to do now? I want to wish you a Merry Christmas. I want to wish you a Merry Christmas. I want to wish you a Merry Christmas from the bottom of William's heart. Yes, I know, Andrea. That's why I'm trying to correct him because it drives me crazy every time. Yeah, what does Andrea say? Always that you always pronounce their name wrong. Yeah. And it's easy. And Wendy McCartney's there. <laughs> Merry Christmas and happy holidays to all your family. Thank you. And John Duhan says, do do han han han, do do han han. I met a John at a truck stop one day, do do han han han, do do han You know, one of these days I'm going to get a custom made t-shirt made that just says do ham and send it to that whole family and That's change right. their name. Yeah, we should get one for all of them that say the do hams. <laughs> so that people now know who they are. Um, what is that uh, That really good one? There's Feliz Manitong or something. Oh, Manitong. <laughs> oh my gosh. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. 
I need sleep. <laughs> you do need driving sleep. Driving for 24 hours. Maybe mom Wait, needs did I say that home. on live video? I just <laughs> said I've been driving for 24 hours on a live video. Um, let me uh, erase <laughs> that part of it. I haven't been. Of course, he was just kidding. It yes, was I'm just kidding. But if people were following me and I was in Calgary yesterday and Regina this morning and Winnipeg tonight. Now that all the DOT are here, we want to say thank you. Yeah, that's, that's right. We want to thank you for your service, DOT and MOT. We really appreciate you. We want to thank you and don't come for us. Yeah, that's right. And if you need an extra 20 for Christmas. <laughs> uh, William always says he never met a city cop, couldn't use an extra 20 bucks. <laughs> Yeah, Angie, oh, did she ever trick me one time. She told me in her area, if I get pulled over for speeding, all I have to do is roll down the window and drop a 20 out the window and don't worry about the tickets. So, I am. Before we lose the video. And uh, in any case, the uh, uh, so I got pulled over. Great big traffic cop walking up. I dropped the 20 out the window. He picks it right up and he says, excuse me, did you drop a 20 out the window? I said, no, sir, that, that must be yours. He says, no, mine's a 50. That was funny right there, right? Eh? Wasn't that funny? Yeah. yeah we, hey, you got a joke you can tell, John? A nice clean one, not any of them dirty school jokes or anything? You got a clean joke? Andrew, you know a joke that you can tell? No. Get the people laughing and everything else, because that's the thing. John, what were some of those jokes we were reading through? They were yeah. funny. Yeah. Do you remember we, any? We always want to be no hate, no drama and everything else that, that, and having a yeah. great time okay you gotta trace back to before the call so we like giving we like stuff. laughing and having a good time <laughs> okay i have to go to That's sleep it. yes okay so we're gonna do the draw in a minute oh there we're waiting for michael patrick murray merry christmas and folks that's mike that's chain them up the famous chain them up people with the chain and up ramps who's been nice enough who's been fantastic enough who's been donating these 50 dollars visa mastercards and mailing them out priority post to the people that are winning them and some lucky person tonight is going to get another 50 dollars thanks to chain them up and we're also going to give away three chain them up ramps coming up in the next few days oh, oh. So, uh oh, they're gonna get us. The, uh, they're, they're the watching the video. It's the DOT. <laughs> the DOT's after me. They're saying, oh, we're glad you mentioned this. Um, so, yes, uh, Mike and the gang there, and Jess that you see on the videos, awesome people. Chain them up. Great safety device. If you don't have one, you're nuts! Because we got one on the back of our truck, right? We yeah. got one. Earl has used his, and uh, Shauna's got one. They're great to have. Chain them up ramps. And thank you, Mike, from the bottom of my heart. We want to say one, two, three. We want to wish you a Merry Christmas. We want to wish you a Merry Christmas. We want to wish you a Merry Christmas from the bottom of our hearts. Oh, Mike is so great, but now he hates us. <laughs> he broke in his phone. So, um, oh, police again, they're coming. Oh, on. yeah, they're surrounding <laughs> us. <laughs> we're getting surrounded. We shouldn't have mentioned hours of service. Jay Bruce is there. How are you doing? Jonathan LeBlanc, good evening. Merry Christmas to you and your family. And, uh, and, uh, Shauna Grace says, Thanks, Mike. We're getting surrounded by the Popo. <laughs> and, uh, the, um, uh, yes, he is absolutely fantastic. Shannon says, wow, you're just a barrel of joy tonight. <laughs> Love it. Thank you. Thank you very much. We're going to try to have lots of fun. Tomorrow, we're going to do some singing. And we're going to sing one of the favorite songs these guys do, which is Riptide. Can I say it right? Is that what it is? And it is a fantastic song. These guys do a great job. So join us tomorrow night at 9 o'clock when John Wayne McKenzie does a solo of Riptide and Dr. Hook, the cover of the Rolling Stones. And then maybe even Angie by the Rolling Stones. Maybe. So I think I'll take the bag. Heavenly Jail's just around the corner, that's right. And uh, we're gonna take the bag and we're gonna shake, 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 shake it up. Shake it up, shake it up, shake, shake, shake it up. And William, we're gonna get you to reach in and just pull one out. 
All right, so one out. Good. And he's digging in. He's digging to the bottom. And I grabbed and this one. And he grabbed right one here. and showed it to the camera. It says Carl Freeman. Oh, does it? Hold it to the camera. Um, oh, so Carl Freeman. I don't think Carl's on. Oh, Earl Little's on. Uh, too bad. I thought you grabbed Earl's. And Don says. The Popo are probably going to give you a gift. Yes, they are. Yes, <laughs> They're going to they give are. a ticket yeah. for a gift. You're going to give me a thing. And Sharon says, <gasps> heard them sing before. Can't wait to hear them again tomorrow. Yes, they are fantastic. John says, you need a cap gun when you say that. Yes. Draw my name, says Mary. And uh, Shauna Gray says, congratulations, Carl. And Don says, congrats. Yes, congratulations, Carl. You just won a $50 gift card visa card from with it's a visa card it's a gift that we're giving from chain them up from mike and the gang from chain them up you got yourself a 50 dollar visa card and i i don't think carl is on tonight but uh wanda says congrats rennie says congrats carl fred congrats carl ricky haynes says congrats carl i love that they're coming on saying congrats carol Marsha Pick, congrats, Scott. We got a great family here. We the, sure do. The Canadian Trucking Magazine family, folks, is the best family ever. Carl Bazin, congrats, uh, Carl. TJ Young shared. John Duham, congrats. Did I say Duham or Duham? You said uh, Duham. 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 And all you need so, to do to enter yourself is you need to share this post and all of our posts. You gotta give this a like and subscribe to the YouTube channel. You, uh, just Ryan Swain says, sounds like Angie needs some sleep. Yes, she yeah. does. And Sharon, congratulations, Carl. Earl Little, congrats to Earl. And Andrea Duhan uh, says, congrats. And uh, Mary Annie Lewis, congratulations. Yes, Carl, congratulations. And, and Don says, listen to Colleen Ballinget's Christmas Carol. It's cute. You know who I really love singing, folks? And I really, really love it. And Ricky Heen says, Dave, I got my chains on the truck tires off to Kelowna. You got to win a chain them up. You need one of those ramps. Jaws says, uh, congrats uh, to uh, Carl. Uh, Keith shared tonight. And TJ Young says, I love trucking night, guys. Uh-oh, he's going to be sued. He uh -oh. says, I love trucking. And um, so, everybody, thank you so much for coming on tonight. Uh, we're going to have some fun tomorrow night. I'm going to go and get some sleep before I got to make my two o'clock in the morning delivery. Angie says she's got to go to sleep. William is asleep right now. <laughs> yeah. I, he's just pretending to be awake. And John, well, we wonder if John ever sleeps because Andrew tells us that he seems to be up all the time. He's like an owl. And I said, who? And John, he's like an owl. I said, who? That was funny, you right there. Is it who? Isn't yeah. that very, very yeah. funny? Yeah, well, you guys got to think up some good jokes to tell these people. And next time, you people. Tell you people. See, I'm going to be like Don Cherry and get fired now because yeah. I said you people. And uh, so I got to go and avoid the DOT and the MOT tonight and tomorrow because they watch these videos and they'll just be waiting for me now. We're in a police van. We can outrun them. Yes, we are. Hey, yeah, we are too. Uh, oh, don't tell the people what we're in. Um, the uh, But I just blew it too. And uh, uh, Fred says, uh, hey, hey, Dave, I'm faster in bed as you are. I'm already there. Excellent. Uh, Keith says sleep. And LOL, sleep as well. Mary Annie Lewis, John, sleep. No. No. Sleep. So from all of us to you, I would rather hear from you than about you. And you know what we should tell them? We should tell them what Craig Cowan always says. Make sure you drive safe. Drive to your abilities. Drive for everyone else because everyone has the right to make it home alive. To make it home alive, everybody has that right. We're counting down to Christmas I and we're going to spend Christmas night with you folks because you're our family. We're going to do a special Christmas night one. So from all us Mikanekskis, you're too far. We want to wish you a Merry Christmas. We want to wish you a Merry Christmas. I can't get you in. We want to wish you a Merry Christmas from the bottom of our hearts. And keep on trucking.